Hey YouTube, the Autobot Fox here, and today I'm apologizing about how late I am with this, but today we're going to be reviewing Studio Series number 57, Off-Road Bumblebee. For the packaging, we have this beautiful render of Off-Road B. More Off-Road B, 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 B. That's it with the packaging. Now, here we have this glorious Jeep B. This really looks fantastic, and I wish I didn't... And I wish I would have given it the praise that it really deserved before I actually had it in hand. Now, for some detail, we have the grill here, headlights, the steering wheel, and the actual seats inside. And here we have his cannon. Uh, so, yeah, why not get down the transformation? So, what I like to start off with is flip this windshield down. Take the arms out. They just go into this little slot right there. And then just take them out. Uh, pull this grill down. And then it will just go under. Oh yeah, and then pull that like that. Oh, right. I forgot to take out his blaster. Uh, untab the wheel. And then flip that down. Also flip that down here. Separate the legs. Flip the seats down. Untab the feet from this right here. And then they just hinge out, rotate them around. And now you take this, it just goes around. And then the, t the tire goes into, like, the leg. Alright, same on the other side. Okay, untab that, untab the foot, rotate it around. Take this, flip it around. That just goes down. Now, here we're going to take the arms. Wait, forgot to untab the hood. Now, take the arms, take them out like that. Take the fake uh, front section of the car. Does that. <laughs> All right, almost forgot. Got to flip the head out. There we go. Flip the grill in. Now, uh, there we go. Flip the steering wheel in. Pull the arms down. Now, here we have Off Road Bumblebee in this fantastic robot mode. It looks really accurate to the movie. This is now something that really caught me about this is the fact that he's shorter than Studio Series. Number 10, Jazz, which Jazz was a really small figure. Now, this is ridiculously small, yet ridiculously accurate. Alright, accessories. He comes with his blaster, done in no paint. Now, this accessory does not come with this figure. It came with the Volkswagen Bee. So, here we have his blade. Now, his blade can actually go into his arm. Go go into his arm like that that's what these two slots are for now in the other arm the blaster can only go into this arm there we there we go there's off-road b articulation arm can go up that far can rotate that far go back that far elbow can bend at a bit over 90 degrees can go back uh he can kick this high, kick back that far, knee bend a bit over 90 degrees, ankle can move forward and back 360 and can rock side to side. Head on a ball joint so it can do a full 360, a bit of wiggly waggly. Uh, it can look up if you want. That looks creepy. So yeah, thank you for watching my review. Please stay tuned for the next one, which I don't know when it's going to be, probably in July. Uh, leave a comment if you want me to review a few Siege figures and Earthrise. So yeah, thank you for watching. See you all later.